measures of central tendency. A measure of central tendency is a summary statistic that represents the center point or typical value of a data set. These measures indicate where most values in a distribution fall and are also referred to as the central location of a distribution. In a simpler term, measures of central tendency are referred to as averages. In statistics, the three main measures of central tendency are the mean, median, and mode. The mean is the sum of the value in a data set divided by the total number of given values. It is also known as the arithmetic average. Six friends in a biology class received test grades of 92, 84, 65, 76, 88, and 90. To solve for the mean, we are going to use the following formula, wherein the mean is equal to the summation of x over n, which is the total number of the given values. So we are going to add 92 plus 84 plus 65 plus 76 plus 88 plus 90. and divide it by 6. So, we will get 495 over 6. And the answer is 82.5. 82.5 is our mean. The median is the middle value in a distribution when the values are arranged in ascending order. To find our median, you must arrange the following data in ascending order. For this sample, the order will be 1, 4, 8, 9, 12, 14, and 21. Since the total number of the given values is odd, the middle term will be our median. In this sample, the middle term is the number 9. Therefore, our median is 9. Again, the first step in finding the median is to arrange the given values in ascending order. For this sample, the order will be 23, 46, 77, 89, 92, and 108. Since the total number of the data given is even, we will get the two middle terms and divide it by 2. The two middle terms is 77 and 89. To add the 2, it will give us 166 and divided by 2, it will become 83. Therefore, our median is 83. The mode is the most commonly occurring value in a distribution. In this sample, 15 appeared twice. This means 15 has the highest frequency. Our mode will be 15. Eight novels were randomly selected and the numbers of pages were recorded as follows. 415, 398, 402, 400, 420, 415, 407, and 425. Find the mean, median, and mode. To find the mean, add all the values then divided by the total number of data. The sum of all values is 3,282. We shall divide it by 8, the total number of data given. The mean is equal to 410.25. To find the median, arrange all the data in ascending order. The order would be as follows. 398, 400, 402, 407, 415, 415, 420, and 425.
since the total number of the given data is even, we would get the two middle term and divided by two. Add the two middle terms, 407 and 415. The sum is 822. 822 divided by 2 is 411. The median is 411. To find the mode, find the value with the highest frequency. In this problem, 415 appeared twice. Our mode is 415. This is an example of unimodal distribution. Seven mothers were selected and given a blood pressure check. Their blood pressure was recorded below. 135, 121, 119, 116, 130, 121, and 130. Find the mean, median, and mode. To find the mean, add all the values then divided by the total number of data. The sum of all values is 872. We shall divide it by 7, the total number of data given. The mean is equal to 124.57, rounded to the nearest tenths. To find the median, arrange all the data in ascending order. The order would be as follows. 116, 119, 121, 121, 130, 130 and 135 Since the total number of the given data is odd, we would get the middle term which is 121. Our median is 121 To find the mode, find the value with the highest frequency. In this problem, two terms appeared twice. The mode are 121 and 130 This is an example of bimodal distribution